Meanwhile, the man accused of firing the bullet that killed a pregnant 14 year old did not show up for court today. He faces murder charges. Haley Mason talked with the victim's cousin today. Just before court this morning, Suleiman Diallo said he was too sick and needed medical help. When medics cleared him for his hearing, he decided not to show up. I talked to the victim's family today about what they want to happen. Police say 20 year old Suleiman Diallo was on the second level of this apartment when he fired a gun. The bullet went through the ceiling below and hit 14 year old Sonia Star Harrison in the head, killing her. The teen was several months pregnant. The baby died too. I hurt. Did I might to say it can't then, can't then bring her back. Today, her family learned from CBS 46 that Diallo chose not to appear in court for an initial hearing. Star's cousin didn't want to show her face, but tells us she often saw Diallo around the Pavilion Place apartments where it happened. He homeless. He ain't got nowhere to go. Well, he can fit in. He'll just... He'll go with the flow. According to Fulton County Jail Records, Diallo has been arrested several times over the last few years. In late September, he was arrested for theft. In July, shoplifting. And in 2017, he had multiple probation violations and charges for battery, drug possession, and cruelty to children. Meanwhile, Shantavius Wood says her little cousin was fun-loving and her family is torn. Like, she was like the dance. She was always smiling, just goofy. Wood says she wants to make sure her cousin's killer does not get out. I want him in jail. No coming out. I want him to die in jail. Family tells us they will hold a candlelight vigil for the slain teen on December 4th. They're planning her funeral for later that same week. Diallo's new court hearing was scheduled for a couple weeks away. Reporting outside the Fulton County Jail, Haley Mason, CBS 46 News.